Hello viewers, and welcome back. Today, we're delving into an important issue affecting the Iraqi dinar, its scarcity in local markets. Basim Jamanani, an economic expert, sheds light on the reasons behind this scarcity in an interview with Al Farat news agency. According to Jamanani, the scarcity of the Iraqi dinar can be attributed to several factors. Firstly, people hoarding and utilizing the dinar for day-to-day -day transactions and trading activities instead of the US dollar have contributed to its scarcity. This preference for the dinar over the dollar in local markets reflects a shift in consumer behavior and economic activity. As individuals increasingly rely on the dinar for their financial transactions, its availability diminishes in the market. Jaminani also highlights a societal trend towards the process of dollarization, where the US dollar becomes the dominant currency in a country's economy. This shift towards dollarization is viewed as a significant mistake, as it detracts from the use and circulation of the national currency, in this case, the Iraqi dinar. As a result, the Iraqi dinar's presence and circulation in the local market have decreased over time. Furthermore, Jaminani points out that societal priorities have shifted towards investments in property and real estate, further reducing the circulation of the Iraqi dinar. This trend reflects a broader socio-economic phenomenon where individuals seek alternative investment opportunities, often favoring tangible assets like property over traditional currency holdings. However, amidst these challenges, Jaminani offers a glimmer of hope. He suggests that citizens can be reassured if the sanctioned banks are restored and managed effectively. Restoring their functionality and trust in banks can contribute to stability in the financial sector and potentially alleviate the scarcity of the Iraqi dinar in local markets. Now, let's delve deeper into the implications of the scarcity of the Iraqi dinar and its potential impact on the economy. The scarcity of the national currency can have several ramifications both at the individual and macroeconomic levels. At the individual level, limited access to the Iraqi dinar can pose challenges for daily transactions, hindering economic activities and impacting livelihoods. Moreover, the scarcity of the dinar may also affect consumer confidence and sentiment. When individuals perceive a shortage of the national currency, it can lead to uncertainty and reluctance to engage in financial transactions further exacerbating the issue. On a broader scale, the scarcity of the Iraqi dinar can impede economic growth and development. A lack of liquidity in the market can constrain investment opportunities, hinder business operations, and dampen overall economic activity. Additionally, it may undermine the government's efforts to stimulate economic growth and implement monetary policies effectively. In light of these challenges, it's essential for policymakers and stakeholders to address the root causes of the dinar's scarcity and implement measures to restore confidence in the national currency. This may involve initiatives to promote the use of the dinar in local transactions, strengthen banking infrastructure, and enhance regulatory frameworks to combat hoarding and illicit trading practices. Overall, while the scarcity of the Iraqi dinar presents significant challenges, it also underscores the importance of fostering confidence and stability in the national currency. By addressing the underlying factors contributing to its scarcity, Iraq can promote financial inclusion, stimulate economic growth, and ensure the resilience of its economy in the long run.